sing hallelujah we praise you holy 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 lord almighty hallelujah we praise you holy 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 lord almighty Provincial Director, Dr. Nzimande, Council Members of Elangeni Tivet College, the Principal of Elangeni College, Ms. Zodwa Arieti, the Deputy Directors of Elangeni College, Campus Managers of all the eight campuses of Elangeni College, the heads of departments of Elangeni College, senior lecturers, lecturers, parents and guardians, graduates and students, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. It is with much delight that I welcome you on behalf of Elangeni Tivet College. In our fourth term as council members. In the same breath, I congratulate all the graduates for successfully completing their certificates and diplomas. This occasion marks a great day in initiating of the college graduates as they receive their hard-earned certificates and diplomas as they will be ushered into the world to be the forces of development both provincially nationally and globally to the college it is a mark of growth that we have nurtured and equipped you over the last years that you have spent in the college. As a council chair and as a council members, we believe that you will make a huge impact in the declining economy of South Africa and the province. 
this graduate, this graduation, the special graduation ceremony, considering the challenges that are facing our country and our province, both the COVID-19 pandemic and also the period that was faced in July when there was unrest throughout the province. We're proud of you for achieving your certificates and your diplomas. As the college, we have been showing growth from all programs that are offering. We have seen that we're making a huge impact in our communities by the number of students that are applying in the college. We, as a college, have made great strides globally with partnerships that we have with countries like uh, British or England, China, where we have exchange program of students and also the United States of America. We are proud that the students or the graduates that are produced by this college can make such a mark. We are proud about the quality of graduates that are coming from this college to our research and development unit, which every year we're introducing new programs for the college, especially the NATED and also the NCV programs. We're proud that we're producing not students that are robots, we're producing students that are both uh, excelling technically, they're innovative and they're creative, and also they make a huge contribution to the country. Ladies and gentlemen, we are also happy that our government is providing assistance to education to our students, which in the past, as a country, we have never experienced that such a huge financial support coming from government to ensure that in each and every family there is a graduate. Yes, the college is facing challenges like any other institution of higher learning. The issues of gender-based violence, the issues of unemployment, the issues of inequality, and the issues of poverty. Those are the issues that cannot be addressed by the government alone. But all of us, as graduates that are going to face the world, you will have to contribute. We as a country also have a declining economy. Our GDP is less than 2%. So which means the students that are produced by the TVET colleges should add value and ensure that we have an economy that is sustainable, an economy that is growing, an economy that is going to change people's life. I'm happy that I welcome you all to the real world, the world where you will have to use the skills, use the competencies that you have acquired at a college like this one. It is my, my wish that as you leave this college, go out there and lift up the flag of a Langani College and be a change agent and be the ambassadors of this college. I want to take this opportunity to thank the parents and the guardians that have taken their time and allowed their students to come and join this college that is bringing light 
where there is darkness. Understand the teaching staff for the efforts that they have been making through the difficult times of facing COVID and unrest. Also, want to thank the council members that have been there behind every successful college. There is a council or a board with, with integrity. Also, want to thank also the principal for leading in such times like this. Tough times, they will never last, but tough people do, unquote. Therefore, I want to say from now, the graduation ceremony can begin. The celebrations must start. Let's keep on enjoying and celebrate this day. Yes, it might seem as if it's dark, but you must know that behind every, every dark cloud there's a silver lining. I want to thank you all those that have attended and all those that have assisted to ensure that this day is successful. To say yes, we in future are expecting that Elangin will have more than 10,000 graduates within a day. And I know it sounds like a pipe dream, but there's nothing impossible in this world. And I want to thank you all. Elangin Tivet graduates, I congratulate you on your achievement and wish you luck. I salute you, you have all traveled and completed this journey in efforts of changing your lives. I wish you luck on your journey. I wish you growth to be self-reliant and mostly to be independent. Leaders, please encourage the young youth to take up space and make them realize that education is power. A long initiative at college produces many skills and talents. In you, I see business managers, I see financial advisors, I see catering businesses growing day by day, and I see artisans in big industries. The courses you have all selected when registering will determine where you belong in life. And from where I see it, you have reached the platform you have always wanted in life. As you move on from the college into the world of work, do not forget your roots here at Silangini College. And on behalf of the SRC, I wish you luck. Thank you. Chairperson of the council and the council members, senior management, SRC chairperson and SRC members, diplomats and their families, staff and students of Elangen Tivet College, all protocol observed. I greet you all. Dear graduates, the students of yesterday, the graduates of today, and the future entrepreneurs and artisans of South Africa. It is always an honor for me to stand here and to award the diplomats that you have earned. It is heartwarming feeling to know that you have reached the end of your studies and are well on your way into the working world. We are living in the world where uncertainty and complexity are more and more increasing. We have experienced a crisis in more ways than one, especially due to COVID-19. We have also learned that a crisis always comes at a time when we least expect its timing. As graduates, most of you will be involved in crisis in one way or other you will have to answer these questions. Do you have enough knowledge to tackle this crisis? Do you have enough leadership, time and resources to overcome crisis post school? I believe that most important thing is to have enough passion and strong will to defeat a crisis and a strong will that you never give up, even after many failures. The day of graduation ceremony is one of the most important days in the life of a student. This day 
is often even more important for parents and grandparents than for the graduates themselves. I look forward to the graduation ceremony every year to see your happy faces which are full of expectation and determination. Unfortunately, due to the current epidemiological situation of COVID-19, a college decision was taken to go the visual route, making it the first of its kind. Like all the higher education institutions, we are transitioning towards 4IR and it is for this reason that Elangen Tivet College is known as an institution of choice. During these difficult times, the college and our teaching staff made an incredible effort to allow you to finish your studies on time. I want to express my gratitude to our lecturing staff to their extra extraordinary effort. My hope today to all the diplomats is for you to continue after your graduation to practice the values and lessons many of you have done so naturally in your campus activities. Never give up on your dreams. For you to achieve your dreams, you must work hard because most of life is hard work. We are inspired by people who have experienced difficulties and never ever give up. We must set our mind to achieve our dreams because the mind is a driver for your success. Indeed, even in this time, the way you think can lead to self-sabotage as the crisis may cause you not to think more and be more innovative. It may lead you to stay in comfort zone and great things never come from mediocrity. When the world beats you down, find a reason to get back. Try, try, and try again. Feed your mind ideas of success, not failure. Whilst government is expected to apply a youth an intergenerational lens in crisis response and recovery measures. The mindset must be intact because if you allow distractions, your achievements that you worked for will disappear. You must seek help with mental health and well-being. I am calling for solidarity across all generations so that we will help one another so that the fire that is burning inside you of following your dreams can bear great things and exciting things. I want all of you to be leaders in your communities and continue to interact with your fellow students and join our alumni activities in many ways. I hope that Elangeni Tivet College will remain a place where you want to come back to after graduation, often in your memory and sometimes in person. You are always welcome to come back. With those words, congratulations again on your graduation and good luck to you all. Thank you. Business Management
सिविल इंजीनियरिंग इलेक्ट्रिकल इंजीनियरिंग फाइनेंशियल मैनेजमेंट Human Resource Management. Management assistant.
पब्लिक मैनेजमेंट Congratulations to all diplomats. 
Today marks a very important day in the calendar of Elang and Tivet College. It's the day whereby as an institution we look at the work that we've done and the contribution that we've done in developing young South African to be able to uh, participate meaningfully in the economy of this country and in the economy which is um, knowledge intense. We proud ourselves as an institution for, uh, for this achievement. We know that it's not only us as an institution which is celebrating today, the parents of the graduates today are also celebrating. We want to say we congratulate you parents. In some parents, this graduation brings a glimpse of hope to say the life in their families will never be the same again. Also in our students, we know that this graduation means that your life will be able to change from now going forward. You will be able to go out there and be able to look for employment with the, with the qualification that you've acquired with us as a Langen Tibet College. Uh, we want to say we understand that the impact of COVID-19 has made us not to be able to be in our halls whereby in our stage our learners will be crisscrossing our stage dancing, uh, showing the excitement and the joy that they have uh, in terms of this graduation and this achievement today. We want to say we are with you in this excitement. We want to thank you as well for giving us an opportunity as Elangani College to impact your life meaningfully and ensure that uh, you achieve these positive results. We want to say also, ladies and gentlemen, that today marks a very significant milestone in our institution. This is the first time that Elangani Tivet College is hosting a virtual graduation. We want to congratulate the senior management. We want to congratulate the principal of the college in specifically for carrying a vision of ensuring that this uh, Elangen College is counting amongst one of the colleges of the 21st century. We want to say congratulations, senior management. Uh, lastly, college, we, colleagues, we want to thank everyone who has participated in this program today. We want to thank the chairperson of council, Mr. Mbondi, for giving an opening remarks to this graduation. We also want to thank the uh, chairperson of the SRC for her address today. We also want to thank our college principal, Mrs. DJ Ayete, for her keynote address. We also want to thank each and everyone who has uh, participated behind the scene in ensuring that this event becomes a success that it is. Thank you. Yeah.